Hey guys, it's Tammy here with the Dollar Store Chronicles. I wanted to go ahead and get this Walmart haul up. I thought about it and decided, hey, let's just film it because there are so many good deals out there at Walmart. I went into the store, went to the 50% off Easter items, and lo and behold, they had many Easter items, and but they had a lot of Pioneer Women items as well that were 50% off, and they were new spring items. So I was just shocked. I talked to uh, some of the associates there. They said, indeed, that was the case. So I'm going to show you uh, the, the things that I got there uh, for 50% off. I got a few Easter items, but I feel like I got more uh, Pioneer Woman uh, items because let me take these glasses off and see if we can um, <laughs> do that without that terrible glare. I don't have my ring light on. I have the uh, just the window light and then the light above that I have in my room. Uh, so this is, will be my primary filming area, my only area in the house that is untouched by my husband. I actually decorated this room and we call it our grandkids room. When they're old enough to sleep in this room unsupervised, uh, this will be their room to spend the night here at Gia and Poppy's house. So let's get started. I got this, I don't know how, I'm going to have to read, I'm sorry guys, I'm trying to get the glare out of my glasses, but I don't know if that's possible, maybe that's a little bit better right there. Uh, I got this beautiful, uh, let's see, I don't know how to, Easter sign, uh, beautiful made of wood, it was originally $9.98, so I got that for $4, excuse me, $5, uh, I got that for, it's made of wood or that pressed board, but I just loved it and could not pass it up. So I picked that up. Uh, does it make any difference if you do it that way? I don't know. So there you go, guys. We'll learn that as we go along. What's better way for you guys to read things? I know that they show up kind of backwards uh, on um, the video. I am still trying out those uh, headbands from the Dollar Tree, those name brand head headbands. Forgive me, I don't remember the uh, maker, but I, we discussed it yesterday. I just love them. They stay in place. So think about getting those if you like headbands. This is probably my favorite, most favorite uh, pickup that I got. This beautiful tin uh, butterfly. I told you yesterday that my uh, mother passed away and her character, if you will, that she loved all of her life was butterflies. So this is very me meaningful to me. And of course, my sister, who's here with me today, helping me to do some spring cleaning and things like that. This was $11, so I got this half price. This is not a Pioneer Woman. This is just, uh, it's, does it say where it's made? It doesn't. It just says distributed by Walmart. Uh, Bente oh, it does. It's made in China. So here we are. So beautiful. I love that. Oh, I just absolutely love it. And I'm going to put that on my wall. Another item, this is an item of the Pioneer Woman. Let's see if I can get that off. Uh, it says, wipe your paws. Love that. It is uh, more like plexiglass than, it's not real glass. It is, um, let's see. This is a decoration, not a toy. The Pioneer Woman is a Pioneer Woman. Uh, let's see, it was distributed by Walmart, so Pioneer One. I just love that, and I will be hanging that up on my door. So, there you go. That's a good no glare shot, I do believe. Love that. Onward, I got this nice purple binder. I think I'm going to use this for uh, putting my stickers in, just putting holes in there. And I only got this for a dollar. It's really big, but... I don't care. I do have a lot of stickers and things like that, so it will free up some room in other places if I can just corral them in this notebook. So that's what I plan to do during my spring cleaning. I got this room all cleaned up because I am, like I said, primarily going to film from this room. I, I love it. I'm going to reach here and get some coffee. My Starbucks cold brew. Can't live without them. Another... Um, Another habit of mine that is not so good. All right, let's continue onward. Guys, I got 
these as well. They were on clearance for $4.50. I got them for $2.25. It is a purple zip it. It's a hard case. Uh, mediocrely high. There are some hard. There is some bend to it, but it's a pencil case. I love that. I can think of so many uses for this storage uses uh, for my arts and crafts tools that I am doing some storage for my diamond dots that are extra after I uh, finish one of those. Actually, I just ordered about six or seven on Amazon. Uh, what seems like just two months ago, and I'm already down to my last one. Goodness gracious, I just go blow through those. Uh, let's see, another thing that I got half price. I think they, there's not a, oh, $4.98. They were $4.98 originally, and I got this for uh, $2.50. It is a home garland. There was two of them, so I did grab one for me and one for my daughter-in-law. So she could have one for her home. So you just, and in between each, uh, I don't know if you can see that picture, but in between each, um, also, actually the picture is on the back and not on the front. Each one, in between each letter is a clothespin for you to uh, hang photos. And like I told you yesterday, she loves to hang photos. She loves to take photos. I got this, this was on Easter clearance, these two books. I have um, a collection of books for both of my grandchildren. I collect books, uh, Hot Wheels, uh, miniature, the toy miniatures, and um, other things. I collect a lot of things for them. Uh, I'll just thumb through this. This was originally $5. I got it for $2.50. And there you go, guys. The illustrations are just phenomenal. So I got that for $2.50. And then we got the lion and the mouse. That first one was called the boy who cried wolf. This is the only two that I found. Same price. Um, look at that. I mean, the illustrations are just beautiful. Anyway, $2.50. They were on Easter clearance. This is the lion and the mouse by abcmouse.com. I will love to read that to them. Uh, as you, it's a common theme. Most most of the things that I purchase are for other people, so um, it's true. I'm I am always uh, trying to get some things that every. There's another one that uh, of those pencil cases that I paid two dollars and twenty five cents for on clearance. I got this blue one for my sister. She absolutely loves blue, and I know she can find some storage, uh, some things to store in there since we are, neither one of us are in school. Let's see, I'm going to keep grabbing from this bag. Let's see, I did get the Ultimate uh, Coloring Kit. I got that on a half price as well. It was $5, so I got it uh, for $2.50. So I was happy to find that. I'll put that away for next year. Probably, I mean, we did, for some reason, we didn't get to do uh, Easter eggs. I know why. I had to work Easter Sunday, so uh, we were not able to do Easter eggs here at my house this year, but hopefully we can do them next year. If not, I can give this to their mom, and they can do them at home. I'm not going to show you all four of these. I just got this. Uh, it's called Easter Iridescent Cello Wrap. I'm not quite sure if this is shrink it wrap or whether I can use this for gift wrapping. It is very iridescent. I got four of those. Each one cost 25 cents. I was very impressed. I'll see how this works out. Um, I haven't read it in totality. It's 30 inches by five feet, so not too bad. For a quarter, I'll take it. So um, there we go. I got four of those. I also got this sign that the butter, butterfly says Hello Spring. It, it just says Yard Steak Made in China. This is not a Pioneer Woman item, but I was, uh, I'm was i going to put this in a house plant up here in my uh, craft room, I call it. So there we go. It's just beautiful. I hope you can see that. It's just gorgeous. And of course, I've told you the significance of the butter, butterfly in my uh, house. This I also got, this was a $7 product. There we go. It says welcome. It has these tulips there. Love this. This can go on my front door. 
Um, if you can see those beautiful tulips there, that was $7, so I got this for $3.50. So I was so happy to find that. Um, also, what this truck here, the dog in the, in the blue truck, it has a little clip feature here so you can put papers, uh, notes on there. So, and it, and it has an easel in the back so you can flip that out and it just stands on your counter. But you can hang it up as well. So it has double features. This is a Pioneer Woman product. It cost $8, so I got it for $4. I had to have it because of the little dog in the window. I am, I, I think I told you I have two dogs, one that is very mom-oriented uh, and one that's very dad-oriented. So my French Bulldog Jacks, you'll probably see him in videos, no doubt. Um, and hopefully my, I'm going to be able to get my granddaughter to uh, help us in some videos too. This is another thing I picked up. Uh, this is just tabletop uh, decor. It is made in China. It says, Hello Spring. I, see, this is the reason I'm just so shocked that these were half price. It was $5. It's green. And it says, Hello Spring. It, it just stands up on the table. Uh, or I'm going to put this on by my entryway. I have a little ledge, I call it, by my entryway when you walk in. And I'm going to go ahead and put that there. But I only paid $2.50 for this Hello Spring. So I'm so confused. You guys look in the Easter, 50% off Easter, and look for that those, these decor items that are unbelievably priced. Uh, also, this I got a bunch of these uh, frostings. This is the White Creamy Decorator Icing, medium icing consistency. My daughter-in-law loves, loves, loves to bake. So I got her these. These were half price. I'm, I, I think I paid a uh, dollar fifty for these. This is the vanilla uh, each, and they were regularly at three dollars a piece. Same thing. This is just the green icing. Uh, let's see. What's the expiration on these? These are. Oh, where's that's not the expiration date. Let's, I'm just curious. With the expiration this was also a spring item so i was pretty confused about it it says it's medium icing consistency green creamy decorator icing by the brand wilton um i'm not too familiar with that brand i don't i'm not really a baker my grant my daughter-in-law is she loves to bake cakes and make cookies and things of that nature and right now i need to get this covid 25 off before it becomes covid 35 doesn't say when the expiration date is. This might be it. I'm not sure. It just doesn't look like there is a um, 2274 on the bottom of this thing, but I'm not going to spend too much time on it. They do last a while. It might be underneath here or something like that. That's just, I don't want to have another crazy long video for you guys. Uh, red, I got this in red, same thing. Let's see if it has, this one has a, an expiration date. Uh, this is 16 ounces, if I didn't say that. This is in red, medium consistency. Same exact thing. Uh, it does not. It just doesn't have a, that I can see, no, none at all. So there we go. That's the red, um, the red frosting right there. I also got... Uh, this there, it's the Sparkle Gel in pink. Did not pay very much. I paid a quarter for these. These actually, I've never used these. I've, all this stuff will go to my grand, my, I keep saying my grand, granddaughter. She's on my mind. Uh, my daughter-in-law. So hopefully you can see that without much glare. Uh, little glare, huh? There we go. Maybe... Hmm. Can, let me see if I do, I see people doing this. Is that going to make any kind of difference? I don't, well, a little bit better there maybe. Not the best shot. Work with it. I'm working through it, guys. I got these sprinkles, two for a quarter. These are like dust, sprinkle dust. Um, so that's in yellow. These were a quarter. Unbelievable. These are yellow sanding sugar it's called net weight 2.5 ounces 
there's sprinkles it says and it's in obviously the color yellow it's by Wilton this one says it that's not really I don't feel like that is an appropriate um, expiration date but it says 20 2028 so I don't know if that's true it's I have no idea but that's what it says let's see if I can get there maybe you guys can see that a little bit that I still see a glare on there sorry guys maybe having that window open isn't the best idea either uh, not the window the shade um, so we'll get through this thank you so much for being patient when I say I am um, I am technology um, technology I am not so great at technology computers or never doing vi or videos or anything like that I don't even really even take pictures so this is a huge um, change for me so thank you so much for bearing with me I'm going to pull out some more baking items this kind of frosting was also on sale this is also by Wilton it is the squeeze frosting it's called white decorating icing includes round and star tips in here so you can make designs with this i got this i think for uh a dollar fifty uh it is eight ounces and this says 2021 8 of 2021 is the expiration date on that so that's what that looks like so i'll be giving all of that to my daughter-in-law because this girl does not bake so i got i just got two of the, these. This is in uh, white as well. I think I picked up a chocolate. I'm not sure. We'll see. I keep pulling stuff out here. Oh, I got a green. So same thing. This, I can't believe this. This is, I don't think this is correct. The number back here says 2035. <laughs> so I don't know what that means exactly. I have, I don't think that's an expiration date, but there you go, guys. Moving on, do I have another frosting in here? No, but I do have another blue sprinkles. That dust we were talking about, very pretty, Eastery colors, I love that. But there are other occasions that you can use blue and yellow. That doesn't have to be Easter, right? Doesn't have to be Easter. There we go. So that's great stuff. And then I found these Easter cupcakes. I don't think that I paid um, I will say half of $1.50, so $0.75 cents for these um, cake topper, cupcake topper and the cupcake holders. So if you can see that, that has rabbits on the side and the uh, toppers are rabbits as well. So not very much. I went ahead and picked those up for my grand, oh, excuse me, my daughter-in-law for uh, Easter next year. She will definitely find a use for those. So there we go. And then I do have another one of those pink uh, sparkle gels there for her as well to decorate whatever she wants to decorate. So that's the end of that bag. Moving on, one thing I didn't get on uh, clearance, I just wanted to see if I could. I've had my bedroom set for many years, 15 years. It's still in great shape, but I thought I could do a little update by incorporating these new drawer pulls and I'm going to try that. I'm very excited. I love these. These are by Mainstay. Of course, I got them at Walmart and uh, they are satin nickel finish, which is what most of my metals here are in uh, satin nickel. All my lighting, uh, my fans have incorporated satin nickel, things of that nature, my uh, refrigerator, all of, everything that I own pretty much is with little exception is satin nickel so I was very excited unfortunately I only found one of these I'm hoping to go and be able to find another one of those somewhere else um, and do my dress my side tables and all of that that are in my bedroom that's that I didn't show you uh, I need to show you this clock this is a pioneer woman clock and I got that on the 50% off aisle as well. What? This was $13, $12.98 to be exact. Pioneer Woman, as you can see on here. I got this for 
uh, $7. Well, wait, I'm sorry. That's not even, it was half of $12.98. I'm just rounding up. $13 would be, what, $7.50 maybe? $7.50, you guys. Not great with algebra, math, any kind of math. I don't know how I got through college. <laughs> I did, thankfully, but I don't know how. It's just beautiful, and that's the back of it. It's just battery operated. So I'll be, I love this, and it matches. I told you my house is in teal and gray, and so this will work well. I do have some off white uh, items. I also picked this up for half price this round container. This Pioneer Woman as well. Here's the back of it. Kind of a lighter teal, but I don't care. I, I'm going to make this work. I'm going to put something in it. This sticker, of course, comes off. And then you have this beautiful uh, tin. Let's see if I can open it here. I don't have any nails. Uh, I don't know. Oh, wait. It's got a little ribbon. What? So there you go. That's the inside. It's pretty good size. You would be able to fit some cookies or something in there. Oh, I got birds on my stoop. Oh, I love that. Um, and here we go. And that's the side panels. So pretty. I love that. Love it, love it, love it. Okay, guys, I think we're down to maybe the last item that I got half price uh, at Walmart on that 50% off aisle. Unbelievable. Two uh, pails. Not quite sure what I'm going to use this, these for, but I couldn't pass them up. I have pails scattered throughout my house, and um, these are just gorgeous. They come with the wooden handles here. These were, they're calling it spring tin buckets. Uh, decoration only, not a toy. Uh, Walmart, distributed by Walmart in Bentonville and made in China. So I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do with them, but... Anyway, there they are. There's two. I'm feeling like I might be able to put uh, maybe my pencils in here, uh, maybe uh, my markers, something like that, because I've got a ton of those uh, for my coloring books, the adult coloring books that I have. My grandchildren have a ton of color coloring markers and crayons and things like that. So. I'm thinking that's what I'll use it for, but I'm not quite sure. So, guys, that's it for my uh, Walmart haul. Thank you so much for staying with me. Uh, please like, comment, and subscribe. I definitely want to hear your comments. I know that there's a lot of improvements that I could do, and I'm, I'm, you know, really anxious for your input because I need all the help I can get, right? Uh, thank you so much. You guys have a great day great weekend. I'm going to be going out to the Dollar Trees on Sunday. I'm going to be finishing up some spring cleaning up here. I'm kind of doing it in blocks. So I got this room done. I'm going to finish a couple other rooms and then Sunday I'm back out to the DTs and hopefully with a video for you so I can get the information out to you so you can get out there to shop and get it. Okay. Uh, I'll see you then. Thank you. Bye-bye.